Hello guys, it's me, Nikki. Hello. <clears throat> it's the most wonderful week of the year. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Hello guys, welcome to Winter Wonder Week and uh, I'm so happy for today because I'm canceling all my weekend plans. Today, my special guest is Envy Peru. Oh. The best drag queen from Holland. Aw, thank you, yep, baby. you got it. Nothing but facts, baby. For the longest time, people have been demanding another drag queen makeover. The first one was done by Miss Fame, okay. and I felt everything mm -hmm. about myself mm -hmm. come to its fruitation. <laughs> You yes. felt your judge. Yes. yes. So today, Miss Envy Peru is gonna do my makeup all the way. Yes. Like you're not holding back, right? No, girl, no. We got your hair done. Oh, yes. She's gonna have very cute hair, mm -hmm. and we're gonna make a little festive drag queen makeover. And you smell amazing, too. Oh, yeah, thank you, baby. Oh, you're welcome. So <laughs> without any further ado, if you're excited about a drag queen makeover, ah! let's go. All right, so before we get started, you you were doing one thing and I yes. just want to show. I need people. to take all of this off. <laughs> yes. All of these jewels here. <laughs> and I painted my nails, especially for this day, look. Because I don't <laughs> like nails. Just show them your look up close. It's, oh, it's everything. La -ha -ha. That's good light, girl. <laughs> you know, I gotta help myself wherever yes. I can. <laughs> so the first thing you start off with is brows. Is brows. Blocking them. Yes. We're blocking using Elmer's. Yes. Ding, ding. But for your own brows, you use Prosate. For my own brows, I use Prosate. Okay. Because that, no matter how hot it is, yeah. that will stay the whole night. Oh. It will hold, yes. Oh. Okay, yes. let's do Elmer's then. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You like that? Yes. Yes? <laughs> I like the burn. So we met during Pride. Pride. Yeah. That's two years ago. On the canals. Mm -hmm. I was on a boat. Without no makeup. <laughs> yep, no makeup at all. <laughs> and you were uh, performing on the boat mm -hmm. with your house. Yes. And uh, yeah, I was not wearing any makeup because it was blistering hot outside. Yeah. The one thing I remember from that day is that there was a lot of alcohol. But number two mm -hmm. is that you and your house were so professional. Guys, it was hot mm -hmm. out. It was blistering hot out. Mm -hmm. And these girls performed for hours Hours. hours. From beginning to end. In the sun and your makeup looked Flawless. Yes. I mean, of course you guys were sweating, but like it didn't affect the makeup at all. And that's when I knew I was like, one day, <laughs> one day you're gonna do my makeup and tell me all the secrets. Really? <laughs> yeah. Well, one of my secrets is of course, probably you know it, is the green marble setting spray. Oh yeah. Yeah, I sprayed like the whole bottle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because I knew I was going to be like in the sun, in the heat, outside. Right. Um, so I need I need something to hold my makeup and if it's hot yeah and my makeup gets ruined yeah. I don't feel my fantasy anymore I want to get out of the boat exactly and if that would my, if that would have happened I would just jump off the boat <laughs> in the water <laughs> yes in the water <laughs> bye. bye I'm I, I'm done <laughs> so you are the mother of your house no I'm we don't have a mother actually oh you're just we just all equally we just started um, and. We, yeah, we see each other as equal, so okay. I don't consider myself as a mother. But yeah, we just want to have a good time with each other. Right. And, uh, yeah. Who else is in the house? We it's you. Me, mm -hmm. uh, Miss Abby. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. Love the, that name. And we have Ivy Elise Monroe. I'm originally from Peru. Okay. My mom was very young when she got me. She was 20. She All was right. Like a child. And um, my father was a professional tennis player. And, no way. Um, yeah, but he was like in the rising of his career, so a, a child was not part of that. Part of that. So um, oh, no. my mom decided to leave because he didn't didn't saw any future in Holland. With my auntie and me, she was 24 when she left. Oh my and god. And now that I'm I'm like 30, <laughs> beep that out, basically. <laughs> I admire my mother so much because. Could you imagine me with a kid of 10 years old now? No. No, girl. <laughs> no. 
I mean, all due respect, but no. no. <laughs> Sometimes I just dab a little bit with my finger because I just want it to be like a, a second layer of skin. Right. And I love that you don't have any dons haartjes. <laughs> How do you say that in English? Peach fuzz. Peach fuzz, yes. <laughs> do you know why the Elmer's glue is purple? No. Because it's the school glue. Right. So uh, kids can see where they glue their stuff. So that's why it's purple and after that disappears. Did you know that? Oh my God, that's so smart. Because <laughs> when it's clear, they're like, yeah. What is the do you do makeup on other people a lot? Yeah. Oh, you do? Yeah. I'm a makeup artist. I, oh. I do um, master classes and one-on-one -on -one sessions. Oh my God, that's amazing. Yeah, I'm with Queens who wants to start doing drag, for example. In Mainly for Queens? No, yeah, just the other time I just also just a man that wanted to be in drag. Right. But it was a straight man, so I was like, huh? okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do it. What's the name of your boy self? I never... Boris. Boris? Yeah. That's and not a... I never asked you, we like envy. No, yeah. okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's not, it's, not, it's not the name that you expect from me because everybody thinks, oh, you're like a Pablo or a Carlos. Or oh. Something like that, you know? Um, no, but it's just Boris. Because my, my father's name is Boris as well. Oh. So my mother was like, okay. <laughs> all, all the people are like, Display a Boris. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna use a skin refine zone from Mac. A what? Skin refine zone is this is a pore minimizer. Oh, thanks. And I don't like pores. Just use a little amount of it. Right. I've never heard of that. No. Wait, can I see that? Oh my god. Mm. You feel that out of this glides? It does. Usually you have to like. Uh huh. I love a nice subtle layer. I always like to start with the with the lower side of the face and then work my way up. I don't know why. I just like that. Oh god, you answer my questions before I even get there. <laughs> I'm like, why? Yes. <laughs> I saw those eyes like, hmm. So how did you get started in makeup? Well, I started as an actor. Shut up, really? Yes. I love that. Yeah. And from there, you know, it was like hard to get in the bits, especially as a Latin kid. Um, right because there were not a lot of yeah, Latin roles. I had like this very shitty job in a call center, but I was just tired of being miserable there in that call center. So I thought, okay, I'm gonna move to Amsterdam because my boyfriend back in the days were, was living there as well. Right. And then I applied at Mac. Just str straight yes. up to Mac. So you really learned a lot of doing makeup by myself. at the counter. Yeah, right. by the counter and by myself. But then I met the, my colleagues and they were like so good in doing makeup. Right. And um, so I decided to go to school, even though I was working in the counter as well. So to I was like, school for makeup? Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Where did you go? The makeup mansion. I've never heard of that. It's in Sunsport. Oh, One of that's the why I never heard of yeah. it. <laughs> oh my God, I've never looked so highlighted in my life. Yes, girl. Right now, Krylon TV Pain 6 mm -hmm. being applied to the face. I had very bad skin when I was younger. Really? Like acne, acne, acne. And I couldn't get rid of it until I was like 23. Right. Because I started with antibiotics and then I was gone. But I remember my first foundation I bought from Telcel. <laughs> <laughs> and I still remember the name. It's like Instant Cover. And there were like three shades. I'm <laughs> and there was a light, medium, and dark. Fenty is shaking in their boots right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I looked hideous because I put like the dark on, but it was way too dark for me. No. So I went on the streets. Look, I don't have any acne anymore. La 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 la. <laughs> <laughs> and people were like, Did you go on holiday? <laughs> I was like, no, oh, and then I realized, okay, this is not my shade. <laughs> you know what's very interesting to me? You use a dry sponge. Yeah. Why? I don't know. I tried, <laughs> no, I, I, I tried the, the wet ones. I like uh, it, it picks up too much. Yeah. It, it picks up too much? And it gets like uh, patchy. Um, I experienced that, yeah, because maybe it was too wet. Um, right. But I like for my highlight underneath the eyes. Yeah. I like them to have a little bit softer and, and wet. Yeah. But there's no crown here. So. <laughs> <laughs> so I highlighted just the center of your face. I it's love that because it's so different than what I do. But you applied at Mac as well, right? Oh, is that the uh, rumor that we had? Oh no, I, I applied. Oh really? Wait, there's a rumor? Yes. About me? One of the trainers. Yeah. Because I said, Nikki applied uh, one time at Mac. And I, I got denied. You got denied? Yeah. And I was like, how? Oh, I got denied. Because Mac back in the day was yeah. like the one. Yeah. 
Like the everyone got one. excited about the collections. Like there were lines waiting outside to get the collection. Yeah. And like, I feel like that might have been the downfall of Mac is that they didn't rise up with social media. I mean, they're still doing great, I guess. Uh, but they're not just that brand that they used to be where people got so excited for them. Mm -hmm. Ooh. And then end up. Oh. <gasps> yes! Done! <laughs> Done! And then blend this all out. Circle emotions up. Oh. When did drag queen life come up? I always loved makeup and transformation. Right. That always has been like an obsession with me. Because of Drag Race, it was even more exposed to the whole world, right. you know? I was starting at Halloween, doing like drag looks, and people really liked it in my uh, in my Facebook. And they said, oh wow, you look so pretty, and so funny, you should do more with it. And I was like, no, 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 it's just for <laughs> Halloween. This, I'm not a drag queen. <laughs> <laughs> but deep inside, I was like this little queen wanted to come out, oh. but I didn't have like the balls to do it. Then one day, one of my colleagues at Mac, uh, Tabita, right. which is also one of my drag moms, she said, you look way too pretty to not perform. So oh if God. you want it or not, I've booked you on this evening here in <gasps> Amsterdam and you're going to perform. So no. you better prepare. Oh my God. So that's how it started. And what club was it? That was the Amstel 54. Yeah, from there it's, it started. And then the mermaids came, my, my drag house, because we wanted to compete at the Super Bowl, right. which is a very big uh, drag a yeah, drag competition in uh, of yeah of Europe actually, but it's uh, it's here in Amsterdam in the Paradiso. Yeah, I was a guest judge. Yeah, was a, guest a couple of years yeah. ago. So um, we won that that year in all the categories. So that you never, won all the categories. All the categories. God. That never happened actually. And from there on, they changed a little bit of the rules because it was not fair. <laughs> the one house won everything. <laughs> But that explains how good we were. Okay, I'm gonna snatch the nose. Snatch it from the nose. <laughs> Can't breathe no more, snatch, snatch it. it. <laughs> oh. Oh. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> oh. <laughs> then we're gonna set everything with that. Oh my God, I need this powder right now. With a waterproof powder. Yes! <laughs> I use more powder on a daily basis. Really? <laughs> yeah, I do. Who are some of the the queens that you really like paint-wise? The funny thing is, when I first started looking at videos of queens painting and drag makeup, right. well, you are one of them. <laughs> I've always watched your videos. So. I hear that a lot from a lot of yeah. queens, that I was, you know, one of the... Basically, I think every queen here. I've watched all of your videos. A lot of queens come up to me and they're like, you're the one who started me out. Yeah. I'm like, no. Yeah. I don't know what that tells you about my day-to-day -day makeup life. <laughs> like, that tells you that I'm wearing a lot. Well, it's, it's a full circle moment for me, watching all of your videos mm. and now doing your makeup. Oh. <laughs> that is so smart. Just a, a guideline for, because I'm gonna highlight it after. But I just wanna. See, okay, there is the highlight. There's gonna be the highlight. Oh my god, I love it, I love it. How long does it take you to do your makeup? Two hours. That's a good time. Yeah. Well, I know my face now. Right. So I know what works and what doesn't. But sometimes I just like to play with makeup. Right. So I like to take my time. Yep. Because that's the most fun part, you know? Yeah. Experimenting and create a new look. All right, so what are we in the mood for? We're gonna go red festive. Oh. First, I'm gonna put a little bit of powder on the lids. I find it very nice to blend. Look at this palette, y'all. It's cute. Yes. It's by Glam Light. Mm -hmm. You're very active in the in the drag world here in Holland. Mm -hmm. What would you say is the number one difference between drag in Holland versus America. We've got a lot of diversity nowadays. Mm -hmm. We got drag kings, club kids, everything is popping out of the out of the ground so quickly. And mm -hmm. um, I don't see a lot of well, there probably are, but I I don't see a lot of drag kings, for example, in the U.S. Or mm -hmm. maybe they are, but I don't know who they are. But it's very chill. It's small. Everybody knows each other. If people are visiting Holland, what mm -hmm. day is a must see? at a um, club. Well, it depends on what are you looking for. 
So what if you're looking for a comedy night? On Friday. Friday? Yeah, you have the a bar blend, which has like bingos and um, yeah, the drag bingos. But also on the on the Tuesday, uh -huh. you have in the Queen's Head, you have like the, um, the drag bingos as well. Right. And uh, one of my mommies, Tabitha Hostad, and she's like the best bingo queen ever. And what night and what club do we go for for the best performance, aka okay, when you are performing? <laughs> <laughs> the Rotterdam Drag Show uh, is the, uh, it's a drag show, all themed for Eurovision, because the Eurovision um, we is coming. Won! We won, finally. Yes. <laughs> and we're coming to Rotterdam. So uh, there's not a lot of things to do in Rotterdam during Eurovision. Mm -hmm. and. We wanted to create something for the, all the tourists that they can go and enjoy themselves. So we, the, we came with the Rotterdam Drag Show. Oh my God, we should give away two tickets. Yes. Okay, yes. giveaway time. <laughs> if you want to go to the Rotterdam show, all you have to do is finish watching this video, <laughs> subscribe to my channel, like this video, follow Miss Envy Peru on Instagram, mm -hmm. And comment down below who your favorite drag queen is. Yeah. What do you think is the biggest misconception about drag queens? That you want to be women. No, we're just artists dressing up. The drivers think that we are hookers. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? The taxi drivers. I don't know because we look like that, and they, some of them always try to hit on us. I had that once with just the regular taxi drivers. That's why I don't take them anymore because I'm just. You know, I'm an artist, I'm a performer, I'm not a hooker. But some, oh yes. Oh my some, god. Yeah, yeah but some, some, of, some of other queens like to have a little bit of trade, you know, after the show. <laughs> <laughs> I think the comparison to oh all my the gosh. blue girls. Yeah, that's very annoying. Because, like, it's almost as if, if you haven't been on RuPaul, then mm. you're not validated as yeah. a queen. Now, what is a, a secret little trick? Mm -hmm young queens need to know. What is some advice you wish you would have gotten when you just started out? Blocking brows. You know, use alcohol before blocking. Have a good good glue stick. Mm -hmm. Not the braid that we have here in Holland. That is horrible. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> oh my God, I love it. I love makeup so much. Mm -hmm. Oh, you should do a little, oh. Speak to us in Spanish. Bueno, shout out to all my peruanas. Estoy haciendo los ojitos de Nikki. Ahorita estoy usando un negro para escurecer un poquito aquí. Ahorita estamos difuminar. En difuminar es blending. Sí. Okay. Okay. <laughs> if you have glued down your eyebrows, yes. I, I love to have like a highlight on the brow bone. Right. But with a normal highlight, it, it creates texture. So I always like to go with a glitter, but a very Soft glitter in texture. Instead of using a shiny shadow, you mm -hmm. go in with a reflex. Yeah. Mm. Oh, look at that. Oh, do you see that? Yes. Oh, that is such a good. That's nice, eh? That is so nice. I'm going to do that in my day to day life. Oh, that's so pretty. I could slap myself. Oh, slap yourself. No, <laughs> don't slap yourself. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh. I made you some lashes by the way, but <gasps> I think that might be a little bit too big for you. But we we can try. Do you know what household you're in? <laughs> Nothing is too big well, for me. Look at those. Time for a lash. Yes. Oh my God, we did the, well not we, you did the other eye. Yes. And oh, the Look iconic the signature lash. Yeah. There you go. That's one. <gasps> it's so cool because you really can work a big lash. I thought, oh my God, this is gonna be way too big for you. I told you I'm a drag queen. Yes. I always tell my followers, it looks like shit until you put a lash on. Especially with drag, you, you look like shit till the, <laughs> till the end. All right, we're gonna move Ooh. on to some cute lips. So we're gonna add some glitter on the lips as I well. Love What 
are you about to use? Soft and gentle. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! That's what you use? If you're used to soft and gentle, this is a lot. This right here is glazed donut. And it is blinding. Yeah, that's pretty. That's better, huh? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Soft and gentle be gone. I know. Uh, imagine this. When you're performing. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, you might like this one too. It's called Everglow. Uh-huh. It's for everyone. Oh. So we've got that color. Uh-huh. Then when you're more tan, you can mix it, like you can mix. I think we're ready for some hair. hair time to All right, guys, and that is my drag look completed by the best drag queen from the Netherlands, no. Envy Peru. I think I am now part of the mansion, huh? Yes. Right? Yes. Am I allowed in? Mm -hmm. Is Mrs. Hunter allowed in? Yes. <laughs> We need to fix about the name. Oh my gosh, Guys, yes. please come up with the perfect drag name for me. Leave it down below in the comments and who knows, I might finally have a good drag name for myself. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, it's my alter ego. It's like mm -hmm. Sasha Fierce. <laughs> <laughs> All right guys, I wanna thank you so much for watching today's Winter Wonder Week episode. I truly had such a blast. Don't forget to follow Envy on Instagram and all her shenanigans on the road. Go follow her in the Rotterdam show. Rotterdam drag show. Drag show. I will leave all the info down below so you can support my favorite queen. I am hoping that I see you tomorrow, tomorrow. I see you tomorrow. Whole lot less glam, that's for sure. All right, bye.